Revolution. Pocketbook is on a constant stream of device releases. They just announced two after this one. We haven't even been able to unbox this one yet. This is the Basic 4. It's got a front light. It's a six inch screen, multi-sensor touch screen. I don't know what they mean by that. Do they mean multiple touches, which means we can do two points and do pinch and zooms? I don't know. It has Wi-Fi and will give you guys a little bit of shot at the specs at the back, but outside of that doesn't really have much more. They are saying it does have a one month battery on a single battery charge. That's pretty standard for ebook readers let us go and crack a lack this open right now now you know i like this kind of okay here watch what's going on right now because i have a, a small gripe with this let's stop right here i have all this plastic here but i have a very recycled kind of you know eco-friendly brown box now i also have these security seals here I would have liked to see no plastic on the outside because we have the security seals. If you have the security seals, you don't need the plastic on the outside because you have the confirmation that it has not been opened. Also, this thing is really thick tape. I thought I would be able to kind of gnaw it with my nail, but I'm going to have to get like a blade of some sort or some precision scissors. So I'll crack this open on both sides and let's see what's inside. Pocketbook just can't stop creating new things they're just they're releasing so many units is that on i think that's on look i think it's actually on right now let's crack this open put it over here they love documentation over at pocketbook my goodness look at that they have the life with or without a case i love this thing it shows you without a case it goes uh parachuting or i guess cliff jumping or you don't even know i mean it could be any sort of circumstance in which you have a parachute and he just falls to his death without a case so definitely get a case which is weird because they never actually give you a case with any other units they make you buy a case but that's fair because the only way pocketbook can make money after after the device sale is the accessories you have your quick start guide you have your do not throw away certification thing you have your uh, conformity declaration and then you have your warranty guide in multiple languages you also have your USB-C should be down below here there it is whoa that's a crazy layout there USB it's not USB-C oh my goodness wait oh hold the phone everybody it's micro what is happening okay uh, this is a new unit. Yeah, it is. Okay. I was a little bit shocked right there. I'm not saying everything has to be USB-C, but it is definitely a standard. This one has micro and it does have, sorry, but it does have an SD card slot. We also have these controls down below, which has the home button slash middle and then back slash page back or right slash page forward. They're multi-use. So I think this is already on. Like I said, has this just been sitting on from factory? I think it is. And this is a touch screen, correct? Oh, I think it's dead. That's what happened here. Let's charge it and I'll be right back. Sorry about all that, guys. I've never actually received something from Pocketbook, Amazon, Kobo, Barnes & Noble, even Onyx that was dead on arrival. So we had to charge it up, but we are all back in action. We will get into a full review on this, but it does have kind of a lot of the same things they're showing you over the past couple iterations, like Scribble, Photo Frame, your apps, even though it's not Android, and your books up top. This is everything that comes in the box with the brand new apparently micro usb driven basic lux 4 i don't mean to dwell on that but it is a little bit strange how it is running micro and not usb c in late 2023 but a ton more coming up from pocketbook